Hi, my name is Helena and this reading is for the sign of Capricorn. I've divided the reading by the decanates of Capricorn, so if you want to skip to your decanate, um, this video is time stamped. Or you can watch the whole video and get a more well-rounded view of what's going on with your sign, okay? So, um, if you don't know what a decanate is, or you don't know your decanate, um, in the description box, I've left you two of my videos. One is what um, is titled The Decanates and Decans in Astrology, and that talks about what they are. And then another one is The Decanates of Capricorn. Okay? So let's get started with the first decanate, which is December 22nd through December 31st. Okay? So if you're born between those two dates, this is your decanate. What message do you have for the first decanate of Capricorn? Okay, so you could have some water in your chart. So you have the Five of Cups reversed. I think someone has turned their back on you for the moment. They're more hurt than upset. I feel like something happened maybe with you and another person that didn't sit well with this person and you've tried to apologize and let them know that you're sorry but they just they're feeling kinda hurt I see that if you buy this person a gift and um, just really speak from your heart and just go talk to them that they'll come around and they'll accept your apology okay so what other message do you have for the first decanate of Capricorn. Please give us a message. Okay, so we have the Knight of Cups again, upright. You could have a friend who's not doing too great. They might be with a fire sign female, this water sign friend of yours. Or if you have water in your chart, this could be you if you're a man. If you're a female... You could have some fire in your chart, and you could be dealing with a water sign man. I'm seeing this person, if you're a female, I'm seeing this man as just not really being the same as you. Not really being what you want. And I'm just getting that there's no use trying to be friends with this person because they don't want to be friends with you. They want much more. If you don't want nothing with them, my best advice, what the cards are saying, is basically if you're honest with them and you're honest with yourself, you'll free yourself up to go get the love that you do want. And it is unfortunate for them. But the quicker that it gets over and done with, the better. And if you're a man, I'm seeing you offering something to a woman, possibly a fire sign, and they're not being very accepting of it. And I just see 
this person is a selfish person and it doesn't matter if you gave them you know the moon they don't care they're ungrateful as a person okay so what other message do you have for the first decanate of Capricorn please give us a message some of you are dealing with um, a water sign female a Pisces a Cancer a Scorpio I'm seeing all three of these signs so it could be three different groups here You're not really serious with this girl, though. You're just kind of in and out of her life. And for the most part, she's you're okay with that. She's okay with that. But what I'm seeing is watch out. Because there might be some health issues at risk that you could be passing back and forth to each other. Or that she could give to you some kind of, you know, health risk to you, to your body. Something, I mean, it could be a ST, but could also be something even worse, okay? So, I'm just saying, just be safe. Because I see you carrying a heavy burden if you keep messing with this girl. If you're a woman, you could be dealing with two men, a fire, or not, I'm sorry, a earth sign man and a water sign man. I'm, I suppose it could be fire since I accidentally said that, so I might have had to have said that from, for someone. Possibly, okay? So if that was you, then yeah, it could be a fire sign. So if you're this woman dealing with this earth sign or this water sign or something, they're very immature. One of them is jealous. The earth sign could possibly be jealous. And he could possibly leave you if he finds out that you're messing around with someone else. Okay? So what final message do you have for the first decanet of Capricorn? What final message do you have? Okay, so I'm seeing that money is not doing very well. You have the Ace of Pentacles in reverse. You have the Chariot in reverse. Five of Pentacles in reverse. Okay, so I'm seeing you working very, very hard for little money. Overworked, underpaid. You are climbing up the ladder, though. Is it worth all this hard work and effort to go keep going down this road? Yes. I see that in the future, if you keep doing what you're doing, you will make it to the top of whatever you're trying to do so I see you being the boss coming in from outside working inside possibly if you're like a construction but like if you're a woman your 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 husband or your man could be getting a promotion Soon. So if you're not doing good financially, just know that your husband or your 
partner could be getting a promotion soon. And if you're single, someone, a man with money could be coming into your life soon. Okay? So let's move on to the second decanate. And that is January 1st through January 10th. So if you were born between those two dates, then this is your decanate. You could have a, a male friend who is not doing good if you're a male. He could be a water sign male, like a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Mm, possibly too much partying. Okay, let's see. What other message do you have? For the second decanate. Of Capricorn. For the rest of February 2018. Please give us another message. Thank you. Okay, so if you're a woman, you could be dealing with a water or an air sign. You have the four swords reversed. And under that was the knight of cups, so it was under that card. You have the five of swords reversed. You have the moon reversed. You could be dating someone if you're a female. He could be an air sign and he could be really, really cheap. And he's not willing to, to spend anything on taking you out. He's just very materialistic and greedy for no reason. And it makes you feel uncomfortable to let him take you out anywhere because you know how it's gonna be if you're a man there could be a girl you're trying to possibly talk to and um, she is an air sign and she's very shy very inexperienced and I don't see her is being very receptive to you. Okay, so what other message do you have for the second decanate of Capricorn? Okay, so there could be an older woman in your life who wants a lot from you if you're a man. If you're a woman, you could have a fire sign daughter who needs a lot of money from you. Like she could be going to college, she could need a lot of financial aid right now from you and but she could be squandering her money away so be careful how much money you give if you're a female Zeta
Okay, so if you're a female, I see that you could be involved in a very complex relationship with an older man. There could be some financial tie-ups between money and you two. You could be having a difficult time separating right now financially. Even if you're a guy with a woman, I see that it could be like a difficult time financially right now separating. It's just like tangled and tied together some kind of way. But I see you've made your final decision and, and most of it is taken care of and um, you'll be able to be free soon with and everything's going to be just fine financially and um, otherwise. Okay, so what final message do you have for the second decanate of Capricorn? Please give us a message. Okay, so we have the Knave of Swords reversed. Some of you could have air in your chart. The Queen of Wands in reverse. And Justice in reverse. So I see that um, if you're a woman watching this, you could be trying to, you could be dealing with um, an Aquarius, a Gemini, or a Libra who is trying to get to you. There might be some physical distance between you two. I see that you two love each other very much. You could have some fire in your chart, or you could just be very passionate about this guy. Could definitely be a secret relationship, doesn't have to. What it could really, what another situation or scenario that it could be too is, you two are from a big city. And you might not have vehicles, and it might be really hard for you to get to see each other. I see a lot of walking and a lot of riding on buses and stuff like that. But I see you can make it work if you plan it um, just right. And if you're a man watching this, um, you could have some air in your chart. And you could be seeing a fire sign female. And if you're not seeing her, you could want to see her. She wants to see you too, so if you're worried if she wants to see you or not, she does. And I see you walking away from another situation to be with her, okay? So let's move on to the third decanate of Capricorn. So January 11th through January 19th. So if you were born between these two dates, then this is your decanate. What message do you have for the third decanate of Capricorn for February 2018? Please give us a message. Okay, so money might not be doing very well for you. We have the devil in reverse. This is you. In the tarot, you, uh, Capricorn is the devil. So... You're in reverse right now, so what I'm seeing, money may not be doing very well for you. If you are a woman, well, let's do the guys first because theirs are coming in the strongest, okay? So if you 
are dealing with Queen of Swords type energy. If your woman is a Queen of Swords or your wife or girlfriend, she could have spent all your money. Or she could have really drained your bank account to the point where you don't know what you're going to do. You could be going bankrupt. It could have been an accident. There could have been some double clicking somewhere. Um, paying two bills once. It could have happened multiple times is what I'm seeing. Some weird stuff could be happening. Another scenario is that this could be a revenge type thing where she's spending all your money because you might be separating or divorced, but now she wants you back, but you're furious because you have no money, and she wants you back. If you're a woman watching this, you could definitely have air in your chart. If you do not, it's okay. You're boyfriend could be going out partying possibly to the bar possibly gambling having bad spending habits and you too might be getting evicted from your apartment or house or whatever wherever you're living okay so please give us another message for the third decanate of Capricorn Okay, so the Knave of Pentacles in reverse, the Ten of Pentacles in reverse, the Ten of Wands in reverse. So what I'm getting right now very strongly is pregnancy. If you are a woman, you might be needing to buy a pregnancy test soon. You might be one of a couple other women in your family that are actually getting pregnant right now. There could be two or three of you pregnant in your family right now if you're a woman or two of your best friends or whatever could be pregnant right now. I'm even seeing in another situation Two people in one family could be pregnant by one guy. Two, two cousins or two sisters or two friends or something like that. There could be two of you that are pregnant by the same guy. Two or three of you. And he could also have like a bunch of other different women too. And this could be another earth sign as well. If you're a guy, you could have multiple women pregnant. I see two or three women pregnant. So you could have a baby. You could have two babies mama and one on the way. You can have one baby's mama and two on the way. Something like that. And then your girlfriend is at home pregnant. You know? So something like that. Like where your girlfriend's pregnant and maybe your other girlfriend, your side girlfriend's pregnant too, okay? So, what other message is there for the third decanate of Capricorn for the rest of February? Please give us another message. Thank you. I see you trying to rebuild your life after a difficult period of time. 
You have been spending many, many hours, days, weeks, months, and years putting this in motion. And it's finally, finally coming to the point where the lens that you're looking through is getting clearer and clearer and clearer. And you're able to see more clearly into the past, present, and future. And you're guiding yourself by not only looking at your mistakes and learning from them but you're allowing love into your heart and that's the most important thing that you're doing right now that's working how you got to this point I don't know I think it's um, years and years of work uh, on yourself okay so but because you're allowing love and forgiveness into your heart, it's bringing many, many opportunities into your life right now. And I see a booming, like, growth of friends, of, you know, opportunities, of everything. And I see your heart getting fuller and fuller and fuller of joy and love and contentment the more you love yourself and it just it's a really amazing feeling that I have for you right now okay so um, thank you for watching and please join me in my next video when we go through all the decanates of Aquarius okay thanks bye